Hello Scorpio, welcome to your weekly reading. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Scorpio, this is a collective message for your sign, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and North Node. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation. In this reading, we will be focusing on this coming week, Scorpio. Okay, so let's take a look. What you can expect. Scorpio. What do we have for Scorpio? Ten of Cups. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> this is very nice. <laughs> You might be dealing with Gemini, Scorpio. The Sun, the Ace of Cups, the Moon. Wow, wow, wow. Gosh. So much happiness. Pisces energy we have. We also have Leo. You might be dealing with Leo as well. Two of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck, Scorpio. Well, so it feels like this coming week... Uh, the main theme regarding this coming week for you, Scorpio, will be a love-related situation. We have Ten of Cups, the lovers. Oh, wow, someone here really wants you, Scorpio. They want relationship. They feel passion. They feel love. They want to be next to you. This is someone who is planning. Children might be involved in this situation. But this person is very passionate about you. They see you as someone who is very good looking, very uh, beautiful, very handsome. Please take it how it resonates. But um, it's like you have this natural X factor. They are very drawn to you. My gosh, this is someone who is thinking a lot about you. A lot. You can expect um, with the Page of Cups that this person... Um, might ask you out, might ask you on a date, or you will be in touch, but this person is thinking a lot about you. We have the Page of Cups, we have the Lovers, we have an Ace of Cups and this Knight of Wands. So This person is very kind of... Um, I feel that the chemistry is it's, it's intense. <laughs> I would say that. They are very interested in you. This person is in love with you. They are very deep in, 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 in their emotions at the moment with the Ace of Cups and the Moon. The Sun, you make them very happy. This is someone who wants to be constantly in touch with you. Constantly. Constantly. You really have someone who is completely in love with you, Scorpio. For some of you, this is a new person with this Ace of Cups and the Page of Cups. Mm -hmm. And it's like, you might feel a little bit, because it might feel like it's too good to be true, but the, the moon suggests that this person, you might have your doubts, but especially if it's a new person, that's why the Two of Pentacles suggests, oh, I don't know if I can trust them next to the moon, but that's their emotions this is someone who is day by day more into you scorpio more into you really if you met someone recently or you've if you have started to date someone uh this person is in love with you that's it that's it they 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 are planning here the future with you uh, again, it might be a case that children are involved on their side, that this person might have children. But it's like... Um, they just want to be with you. You make, them so, you make them feel so good, so happy. The lovers with the sun, especially next to the Ten of Cups, is like a marriage situation. But I guess it's too... 
uh, too fast to talk about it or maybe it's not <laughs> you tell me in the comment section below but but you have indeed someone who is in love with you and i feel that during this week you will spend um majority of your time i feel you will be spending with this person in a sense maybe you'll be texting or you know kind of chatting um or you will meet up but this time will be very very nice you'll be very happy for some of you haven't met this person and if you're a single well love is showing up big time for you during this week you, you will meet someone new who will pull your heartstrings big time if you are in a stable relationship because it's a collective message uh, well I'm seeing here moments of passion and uh, moments of happiness shared with your partner so either way this is a beautiful reading Scorpio you might be dealing with Gemini Pisces Leo that's what I have so far in this reading for you those signs but let's clarify the reading so while we have the ten of cups and the lovers for Scorpio why the ten of cups and the lovers for Scorpio we have the star you might be dealing with Aquarius. The high Priestess, Spices Energy, Page of Pentacles. The Devil, this person is obsessing over you. Capricorn Energy. They're obsessing over you. They don't want anyone else, Scorpio, in this case. We have the Star with the High Priestess. There is something uh, very spiritual about this connection. And it's like this person believes that you are their soulmate. Uh, they are. Maybe, maybe you are dealing here, Scorpio, with someone who is very spiritual. With the star and the high priestess, but but this this is someone who kind of see direction. It's like they are full of hope that this this. Um, that this connection can be given a chance. I feel that they are hiding, that they are hiding the fact that they are obsessing over you here, Scorpio. And it's like, you know, if you are in touch, momentarily this person might come across as very kind of casual in the sense of they will be sending you very casual messages. But the reality is that this person, it's already attached to you. They are thinking about you nonstop. They don't want anyone else. And this is also someone who puts you on a pedestal it's something about your appearance that they just it's it's kind of irresistible for them they find you incredibly beautiful or handsome and it's this person it's just they just want you scorpio why the queen of wands and the knight of wands because that can be a family situation We have this devil energy. Show me more. Four of Cups, okay. And the Magician. Seven of Wands. This is someone here who doesn't want to kind of, you know, give up on this connection we've already established, but they are very protective over this here is the thing Scorpio I feel that because of this person's uh, behavior and you might feel that they are very passionate but there is something here about them being maybe a little bit too much you know, they are very intense with this Knight of Wands. I feel that, you know, at the end of the day, it's like, I feel that you have your reservations regarding this individual with the Four of Cups, or you will have, because um, it's like, I. 
you be for some of you you're already dealing with this person okay but what i am getting someone here who's very skillful with their words and it's like you have your guard up especially with the seven of wands you have your guard up because you don't want to i feel very strongly experience that sort of kind of a you know charming person that it's not like experience but it's like i feel this person can have a very charming personality and it feels like you met someone in the past like this and this person put you in a third party situation and at the end it just didn't work out and with the four of cups uh I feel that, you know, you've experienced rejection in the past and it's, and I feel that this person here is very passionate and there is something here that you might see similarities and you might have your kind of, you know, reservations with the seven of wands, but overall, this is someone who doesn't want to give up on this. No, no, but I'm getting also very strongly that indeed for some of you, the children might be involved. And um, this is someone here who, who will tell you something about their ex, what they put, what they put them through. Um, you are dealing here with Scorpio, you are dealing Scorpio here with someone who is, um, who is really obsessing over you. I can't emphasize it enough. Really. You might be dealing with Virgo or Gemini. Why Page of Cups in the Sun for Scorpio? Two of Wands. Because that's really good news. It's like good news are on the horizon. That's why we have this energy of moon that makes sense because you might have your doubts. You might be not fully trusting this person. Three of Cups. This is nice. Very nice. Oh my gosh, and the sun clarified by the sun. The Hierophant at the bottom of the deck. For some of you, Scorpio, you receive a very positive message that will make you feel so happy. With the Two of Wands, it's like you've been waiting for it and you will have reasons to celebrate with the Three of Cups and it will make you so happy. With the Hierophant, it might be a case, uh, something to do with employment, something to do with a work-related situation. And it feels like, for instance, uh, um, if you apply for promotion, or something to do you know with something like this okay what I am getting here that you have reasons to celebrate you will get this and Hierophant it's establishment so it can be something to do with your work related matter or if you are studying okay or attending college or university and you had um, you, you you tried very hard to get something um, like a scholarship let's say or um there was a time of 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 tests and you are waiting on the results uh what i am getting very strongly here that 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 wow you will be incredibly happy you will be incredibly happy i see recognition i see um accomplishment and being praised by this um either way please take it how it resonates scorpio a wonderful news are on the horizon with the two of wands i feel that you've been waiting for a long time for this and with the three of cups and the sun which is clarified by the sun you will be incredibly happy incredibly happy and it might be a case that you receive like an extra bonus from work or certain difficult situation will gain a positive resolution, you know, or you will get a promotion. It can be a case, but either way, you will be incredibly happy, incredibly happy. And this good news are coming uh, and will be delivered to you during this week.
Okay. So we have a Taurus energy and very strong Leo. So why the Ace of Cups and the Moon? Gosh, we have this Hierophant. Oh my gosh, we have the Four of Wands energy. Scorpio, someone wants to marry you. Ace of Cups. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Justice. Libra energy. Scorpio, um, it feels like it's a new person or this person is coming your way with the Ace of Cups. But uh, Ace of Cups with the Moon is clarified by the Hierophant, the Four of Wands and the Justice. This is marriage. So if you met someone uh, it feels like this person really is taking this connection seriously. And again, they don't want to give up on this. They want to take it into the next level. They want to kind of maybe both of you to be like an official, to, you know, be an item, be in a serious relationship. This is marriage. Hierophant, Four of Wands and the Justice. And Justice. Overall energy, Ace of Cups. A chance for emotional fulfillment. Scorpio, you have someone here who uh, already is planning a higher level of commitment with you, living together, moving in together, and uh, taking it to the next level and making it official. For some of you, this this you can you can expect that this person will uh, will want to engage or. I see marriage and I know that it's a lot and it's quite <laughs> and you might be thinking oh my gosh what is she talking about but um, that is a classic combination of marriage and with the ace of cups and the ace of cups is like a double confirmation here Scorpio that you have someone who has serious intentions and it feels like there will be a conversation about those plans it's like this person between the words will try to figure out if you are taking them seriously because they will make themselves known to you that they indeed take this connection seriously if you haven't met this person uh, this is someone who is coming your way and during this week you will be in touch with them but this connection really has a chance to grow into something really, really profound, really beautiful. And uh, I've, I'm getting that you will have an opportunity here to create a very stable and serious relationship with this individual, Scorpio. Wow. So this week will be... Um, full of surprises for some of you but it will be very very positive really 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 nice Scorpio I will leave it here thank you so so very much for being with me please like share and subscribe and once again thank you very much for your time I truly truly appreciate you Scorpio have a fantastic and absolutely beautiful day and week and once again thank you very much for being with me I'm sending you much much love Till next time, take care. Bye.